Make sure to stay until the end. We will explain how we can solve that problem without spending any money in most cases. Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Fiat 500. It could be any engine, gasoline or diesel from year 2008 to currently year 2022. If we have check engine light on and code P1300, uh, that says correlation, camshaft, crankshaft, position sensor correlation. Stay with us, we'll explain what causes that. In some cases, you will not need to replace anything to fix that code. All that will be covered in this video today. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. Why we do that? Because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep making these free videos. If you guys need to buy any parts, tools for a good price and quick shipping, check out the link in the description of the video below. That's where we get all our tool supplies from and you can save a ton of money. So with that being said, let's explain what we have specifically here. This is a 2015 Fiat 500 bar. What that code P1300 means guys, it means you have two, uh, two sensors usually, one will be a camshaft position sensor on a dual overhead variable timing engine you may have two camshaft position sensors but we have only one and you have one crankshaft position sensors both of the sensors kind of like look like that the camshaft will be just shorter wire most of the times it's a magnetic sensor that detects uh, the camshaft detects the position of the camshaft the crankshaft sensor detects the position of the crankshaft sensor so now talking about that guys if you get this code often you can get that code if you worked on your car if you took it apart okay you removed any of the sensors if you did timing belt timing chain replacement anything like that you can get these codes another thing if you replace the sensor and you still get the codes you had the faulty sensor okay what do you need to do you need to do a special procedure it's called crankshaft uh, rewarm procedure or camshaft rewarm procedure some people call it uh, crankshaft calibration crankshaft sensor calibration or how to calibrate crankshaft sensor we will have the video guys on our channel it will be called how to rewarm crankshaft position sensor on fiat 500 check it out it will teach you how to do that and that should take care of uh, your problem because uh, if it's not rewarm okay the com engine computer may not know what's exactly happening the car may be running rough and you may get these codes uh, p1300 because the timing will be out of tolerance so hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you needing help with that if you want to see how to replace crankshaft position sensor or how to test crankshaft position sensor we have the video on the channel that will teach you how to do that you can test crankshaft position sensor without removing it really easy step-by-step -step video instructions will be on our channel hopefully the video will be helpful if you have any questions let us know thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time